telescope is an instrument for exploring universe. In 1608, Galileo turned a 3-inch telescope towards night sky. It brought a revolution in the field of astronomy. Galileo's telescope revealed that the universe is far more extensive than the moon and sprinkling of stars. An optical telescope gathers and focuses light mainly from visible part of electromagnetic spectrum. For focusing light, we can either use lens or mirror which will gather incoming light, focuses that light from distant object to a focal plane where it forms a real image. Larger the lens or mirror, more light the telescope collects and finer the details it resolves. When astronomers point their telescope up at the sky to see distant supernovae or quasars, they are collecting light that's traveled millions or even billions of light years through space. Even huge and powerful energy sources in the cosmos are unimaginably tiny and faint when we view them from such a distance. Newer, larger telescopes are always needed to boost scientific progress and the next generation of facilities. Lens is not used in making large telescopes as it will sag under its own weight. The largest refractor telescope using lens is the one at Yerkes Observatory. It has a diameter of 1.02 meters. A mirror larger than 8 meters made of a single piece of glass would be very expensive and too hard to handle. The largest single piece mirror made till date is having only 8.4 meters diameter. Hence comes the concept of segmented mirrors. A segmented mirror is an array of smaller mirrors designed to act as segments of a single large curved mirror. This design provides sufficient rigidity for ultra high precision optics while reducing the weight of the mirror. Most of the future ground based telescopes will have an aperture greater than 8 meters. One of such extremely large telescopes is 30 meter telescope or TMT which is under construction and is expected to be completed by 2030. Primary mirror of TMT is having a diameter of 30 meters. It will be made using 492 individual hexagonal segments of 1.44 meters each like a honeycomb. Building such mega facilities require innovative ideas, new technologies and immense funds. These formidable requirements have forged collaborations between institutes and countries across the world. TMT project is a partnership between Canada, US, India, China and Japan. TMT optical design is based on richer Christian system which uses hyperbolic primary and secondary mirrors. Primary of TMT is a segmented hyperboloid of an effective diameter 30 meters. Secondary is a single piece convex hyperboloid with 3.2 meters diameter. Resolution of TMT will be three times better than the existing 10 meter class telescope. TMT requires a total of 574 segments. 492 of these segments will form the primary mirror and remaining 82 extra segments are used to facilitate recoating of primary mirror and for use as spares. Each segment is just 45 millimeter thick which will make the 30 meter diameter mirror lightweight and easy to produce. Segments are closely placed with nominal gaps of 2.5 mm. Each segment will be mounted on a segment support assembly that provides passive support to the mirror using three whiffle trees and a central diaphragm support. Segment support assembly passively controls the three in-plane degrees of freedom of the segment while the overall shape of the primary mirror is actively controlled by primary mirror control system which compensate continuously for the alignment errors caused by wind disturbance, gravity loading and structural deformations of the telescope resulting from temperature changes. 30 meter telescope became controversial due to its location. Planned location for TMT is on Mauna Kea on the island of Hawaii, the most sacred mountain in native Hawaiian culture. Several protests and demonstrations are still going on across the state of Hawaii. Few other extreme large telescopes which are in construction phase are the giant Magellan telescope with an aperture of 24.5 meters diameter and the European extremely large telescope with an aperture of 39 meters diameter. Why are we here? How did life originate? Are we alone in this universe? Let's hope that the next generation of telescopes will help us in solving these mysteries.